Hey guys, you're here with Night of It for Blender. In this one, we're gonna be talking about two amazing things in a new box cutter 15. Just quickly before we start, guys, if you would like to improve your skills in hard surface modeling or in Blender in general, then consider joining our Patreon where we have tons of educational materials, courses, critiques, you know, decal packs, etc. There's a fantastic course coming to February. Uh, for add-ons and vanilla, we're gonna have some cool spaceship with sub demodeling and bullions and also some Unreal Engine stuff. So check us out, link in the video description. Thanks. First of all, what you will notice is that uh, cutting with box cutter became a bit faster, actually much faster. Specifically, it took care of the uh, very slow animation of um, inset bullion, which you can access by pressing X three times in cut mode. Um, so a bullion that, you know, sort of um, creates kind of like a inset cut here, right? So you can, you know, cut it, press X three times, press T to adjust the solidification and have fun. However, what new box cutter um, is adding is the uh, ability to um, to perform recut on the inset cut. Now, recut is an interesting cut let me show you what it does let's say if i cut this with you know um with a, a boolean like this and then i'm going to you know cut it in here but press alt x recut will recut the cut that the last cutter is actually cutting out if you know what i mean it's, it's it's a bit complicated i know but you know you can create stuff like this which is brilliant you know select this one in the middle and you can have fun you know with recut so recut is actually absolutely genius now what box cutter is offering you in the version 15 which was released yesterday is offering you ability to perform recuts on a, on an inset cut so watch this if i'm going to cut this with a cutter and then press x three times and you know press t for solidification whatever and then press alt x okay and press ok then you will see that i still have a recut underneath but i recovered this shell that was cut out uh you know by the inset bullion so now what i can do is i can do something like this okay so i can cut cut this part that was cut out um kind of like a shell that was cut out by the by the inset and you know i can cut deep and i'll still see um this recut bit underneath so if i'm going to select all and apply all so go to operations and smart apply uh you will see what i mean it's just literally this kind of a shell on top of this recut bit which is genius because you can do um some amazing you know uh, amazing cuts with this one with ease so i think this this addition is extremely useful also i really appreciate the speed of the new of the new box cutter because uh, inset boolean in, in particular was extremely slow uh, but now i can see that you know they fixed it so uh, it's genius if your computer is slowing down by the way you can always um, pause this so sort of uh, pause the the live mode and you will not see uh, the cut being performed uh, as in you will not see the animation where the cutter goes into the mesh but it will work a bit faster so you can just you know enable this and if you have a slower machine um you know you can still see the cutter animation so you see more or less how deep you cut also you can go to live mode with shift and then sort of you know adjust the cutter yeah but this should help you with you know if you have a slower machine but um or you got like tons of you know bullions because blender eventually is going to give up and you know uh, things gonna start slowing down but out of the bat inset is much faster so it's a brilliant addition and the recut on the and the recut on the uh, um, inset bullion I think is just genius because uh, you know this this opens up a whole new uh, plethora of possibilities anyway guys i uh, hope you enjoyed the vid give us a like and sub if you did there are links to box cutter and hard ops in the video description so if you need these add-ons you don't have them i would suggest you get a bundle because that's the probably the best bet for the buck also you will need eventually both of them anyway because they're just different and they work so seamlessly together that it's just stupid not to get them together thanks for watching guys catch you in the next one